Hey, what is up, guys? It's Cool Freak here, back with a new video. If you guys are here after searching the title, you are in the right place. Uh, I was so much tense, guys, about my audio chat is not working. Rainbow Six Siege. I found bunch of crap like set your sound input, you know, an output device uh, as default communication device. But you are in the wrong track. Yeah, it might help for someone who does not update their uh, Windows. Like it's uh, probably for Windows 10 users. Like I can hear the sound of the game, but the voice chat is not working. You know, so uh, this has happened because of internal update of you know Windows 10. I googled as many blogs, you know, all you play forum. I did not find the fix at all. But after so much of research, I found one. You know, on Google, you play Reddit blog about the port forwarding. What the heck is that? First, be aware you may uh, need to configure a static IP if you are experiencing any kind of you know connectivity issue and uh, error. Like while playing the game, might be you have the firewall interfering your connection. To prevent that, you will need to access your router from your PC. When you first buy the router and configure the things, like that you need to configure it again. Even if you pl usually play on your console and all. I don't have a console but I have a PC. Here I have, you know, as you can see over here, I have uh, MI Router 3. If you have this router then follow as I do. I have a full tutorial how to configure this MI router 3. If you want to find that, uh, it will be popping up around somewhere. Up. Moving on. Um, so guys, if you are in the windows, so uh, press the window button and the R button. So on the keyboard and type CMD. After typing the CMD, uh, it will open the command prompt. So a black window with a you know, letter. I will appear this window call command prompt so within the window uh, type ip config f i g so after typing that uh, you will be getting you know uh, ethernet adapter internet settings you know and all and you will be getting a bunch of ip addresses so link local ip6 ipv4 address and subnet and default gateway so i have this thing so you need to copy though only two things uh, that is uh, default gateway the last one and the second last one uh, as you can see over here um, the IP4B network uh, IPB4 address that is the main thing uh, you, need, you need to copy that if you need guys uh, write down both the addresses the default gateway and the IPB4 here is mine you will have the different one in my advanced settings search uh, for port forwarding uh, I have found uh, the Uplay TCP and UDP ports uh, which you can use uh, and fix the things mine is MI uh, your might be different one so if you go into your you know after login the admin and the default password after uh, going inside that after going to that as you can see over here add thing uh, in that uh, name you can keep uh, any you know you play PC make sure you are in UDP protocol so after that uh, next uh, external port uh, you know 6015 uh, this is the external port for uh, Rainbow Six Siege game uh, and uh, then, then the internal IP means your system IP address here I have the you know continuation so I will you know write the last one last digits last is internal port same as external port 6015 uh, after that make 3 to 4 list of port forwarding Minimum keep the values from 3000 to 13000. It, it worked for me. There are a bunch of there and the you play. I, I, you can add as many as. Keep external and internal port same. IP address as yours, not mine. So after that, reboot the router and restart the game. Hey guys, port forwarding is not very harmful to your PC or any kind of your internet speed. It will not affect you. It's not a VPN, but it's like a VPN the service. Uh, if you add the ports so you can access those ports extra it's kind of add-ons so don't worry about it if you are wrong with that also it will not harm your speed network or anything else guys believe me it worked I do you know research after that only I make videos if anything is bugging you you know let me know in the comment section down below uh, feel free to ask in the comment section and I will try to help you as much as I can Hope you get this video very helpful then hit a like button and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel don't forget to hit the bell icon thank you for watching guys i will see you guys in the next one later